way want that pressure hold me all on us Who put the city on it's all on us And if they hate him want it all on us All on us All on us Want that way want that pressure hold me all on us Who put the city on it's all on us Yeah And if they hate him want it all on us All on us All on us Over the summer, here at nearby Miss Enum University, a couple of former Amateur Bop Ed players were preparing for their possible college football debuts coming up. Woo! That boy clean! My name is Trayvon Jeffrey. Um, I'm attending the Howard Manigan University to play football. My name is Carson Snyder. I'm playing college football at Ohio Northern University. If you're looking here, inside, inside, that's your turn foot. Okay. And then, plant, plant, turn foot. These guys have had dreams of playing in college football, and now, coming up, their dreams will become a reality. That's awesome. I mean, it's really exciting. Uh, a year ago, I never thought I'd be playing college football, so, I mean, a year makes a big difference, and I'm ready for it. Be a new, new chapter in my life. It's unbelievable, but I mean, God provides opportunities and stuff, opens, opens up doors for me and stuff. So I mean, I'll we'll take every little bit I really I can, so I can show them when I prove what Cambridge is all about. What's up? For these guys and many college athletes around the country, during the pandemic, training was a bit rough. Uh, it's been interesting for sure. We got, I mean, you got to get creative with your workouts. Because for the first part of the year, we didn't have any gyms open, so as far as weightlifting goes, it's a lot of push-ups, a lot of sit-ups, a lot of tempo stuff, a uh, whole lot of running outside. I mean, that's the best thing you can do, honestly, when you go to a gym. Now that gym's open, backed up, we're back to the grind, and we're just making sure we're ready for the season if we have one. There you go. And also in the back of their minds is the stress of wondering if hard football will come this fall. Um, honestly, nothing's guaranteed, so I mean, we're still up a season, so we're just going to grind it out, just have fun. There you go. Hey, hey, do a little dance for him. Uh. Ah. I step it. Man, you know what it is. That's cool. Oh, stop playing, playing with me. Oh, look at him, look at him, look at him, look at him. Oh, okay. Okay. Oh. There you go. Flip right. Whether they get to play this fall or later on this spring, these two are making Ambridge proud. I'm very excited because I mean they don't know what I what I got and be able to show. Neither I don't know what they like what they're all about either. So. I, mean, I get to prove my worthy and prove to him I'm a part of the team. It's it's awesome. It's real exciting coming from a medium town like Cambridge. I mean, not a lot of people make it out and get to play college football. So it, it's an honor. We want to make everyone proud and definitely rep Cambridge the full way. There you go. There you go. There you go. There you go. Hey. It's another day of camp for the Amateur Bobcats, as they begin the day 
by writing in their temperatures and then heading over to the practice field as they get ready for a 7 on 7 helmet up. in the weight room one day of practice left make sure you're bringing your buddies with you team captains these days also count towards your team all right so days that we miss all right just, just keep that in mind get on your guys let's get a break keep going all right let's, let's go, go let's go, go. hey catch on three family on six one two three count four five six man. This is the weirdest time we've ever had and everything. So how do you make sure that you still push each other to make sure if there is a season you guys are prepared? Um, I think the biggest thing is just um, no matter what, you, you're going to have to be ready at some point. So our guys stay ready for the most part and uh, we just like to get out there. Being a new coach coming in a little bit later, never ideal. Coronavirus, certainly never ideal. How have you been able to battle that so if there is a season you guys are ready? Yeah, so we're, we're uh, planning full speed ahead uh, like there is a season. Um, nothing's going to hold us back. Uh, hit the ground running. Uh, a lot of hard work, a lot of time. 
Uh, the, the assistant coaches have put in a lot of time. You know, they've been very helpful. The administration has been very supportive. Um, it's not an ideal situation with the coronavirus, but you know, we're making it work. And um, you know, just like uh, I tell our kids, there's no excuses, only hard work. So that's that's the memo we're going with. What drew you to be the new coach of Cambridge football? Yeah, so I, I like the community feel here. Um, I've got a family. We're moving down here in a couple weeks. Uh, pretty excited for that. Um, the kids have been very great. Uh, they work hard. Like I said, the attitude's great. You, you can't ask anything else from them. So, you know, that's been a, a, a big uh, part of our success so far. And, you know, the administration support, um, the community support, the people here have been great. So, you know, so far I, I love it here. Thank you Thank very you. much. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you as well. Thank you. I appreciate it. Right. On the next episode, of Return Anime Preseason Returns. Let's go, baby! First competition of the year! We'll put the city on his heart. And if they hate it, we'll hit all on us. All on us. All on us. I'm from Arizona State. It's hot down here. You're a hot man.